Hello and welcome to Gemini Soul Tarot and I am Shannon. I would like to let you know that this reading is for Virgo and this reading is what the person wants to tell you Virgo. Okay, so it is not what you telling them Virgo. It is what they want to tell you. If you want to interchange this and say this is what you telling them, go right ahead. I'm asking my spirit guides to give me the information that they would like to tell you, Virgo. So if you say that's you, there's a possibility they could be telling you the same thing you're telling them for those who want to interchange the reading to benefit them in whatever way, okay? But this is the message that I am getting from them to tell you, Virgo. This may not resonate with everyone. If it does not, I ask you to check the playlist because I have all the other signs posted there. They may not all be up, but over this next week, come back and check the playlist if you have a different sign you would like to check in with. I ask that you give a thumbs up, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification because we will be counteracting this message about the middle of the month where Virgo will be responding to the message or another message that it will just be Virgo speaking at that time. It may resonate with this reading. It may not. Okay, so Virgo, let's get started. And just remember, check the charts for other signs. But this person, first of all, what is it that you want to say to Virgo while Virgo is listening to you? Okay, while well, Virgo's out of that hermit mode, what is it that you would like to say to Virgo? Oh my goodness, Ten of Swords, Virgo. <sighs> this person says, Oh, okay, they know they hurt you, they know you are hurting. All right, let's keep going. I don't know if that makes it right for you, but King of Swords in reverse. The next card that came out was the Queen of Pentacles upright. Let me get this other card out. Now, sometimes it takes a minute to actually see what the Spirit is saying. And then the Nine of Pentacles. All right, I got this message. Okay, here we go, Virgo. This person is telling you that they know they hurt you. They was never looking at the situation, you know, with heart. It was logically. They no longer want to look at it logically because now they understand and see that they hurt you and that you were. It could have been their wife, husband, whatever. It could have been a long-term, a marriage commitment that you were home to them. You was the nourishing person in the family. You held the family together. You held your own. You didn't see things. Both of you guys did not see things the same, but that never stopped you from loving them. They say they know that. And they are sorry that they hurt you. Virgo, I just heard another message. This is for, could be for this, could be outside of this, but they do not want you to wind up leaving them in single. They are sorry, and they want you to stay. Okay, let's keep going. Let's go around the board again. Virgo. Could be dealing with a Gemini. Could it be an air sign? Could be dealing with a Virgo like yourself. Or earth sign. Or they're heavily in their chart. They have water and air. And definitely earth. This person wants to tell you, Virgo... They would like to take a leap of faith towards you and fix what is broken. They would like an opportunity to pull the swords out your back, the deception, the hurt, the pain. And they, would, they are taking a leap of faith towards you because they would like for you to know that 
they are no longer looking at things logically. Let me see. Wait a minute. Wait, what does that mean? Justice. Hmm. They said they know there's no justice in what they've done to you. And they know that they hurt you. They also know that you deserve justice. They deserve, that you deserve all the good things in life that comes to you from this point on. But they just want you to know that now that they're not looking at things with Logically, from the head, that they're looking from the heart. They're feeling from the heart. And they do miss you. They don't want you to take it to court. They don't want a divorce. They don't want a separation legally. No separation. They actually want you to give them some time before you decide to be on your own. You have walked away from this connection and your love is no longer. They can't feel your touch. They're not talking to you on the phone. And they miss time spent with you. They miss how you showed up for them. They know they have not showed up for you in the way they should have or could have. What else do you have to say to Virgo? What else do you have to say to Virgo? Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? In regards to what in regards to what you have. Virgo, they say they would like to come in and make an offer for a new beginning. They say they don't have a lot. They don't have as much as you, Virgo, but They would like to come in and make an offer to you. Also, Virgo, they're saying they don't feel that you will accept this offer. You have your back turned towards it. And they feel you have your back towards this pinnacle because they feel you just want to go your own way and be single. And that you're healing and you're just going to take your abundance and move on in a different direction because they really hurt you. Okay. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here, Spirit? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here for what this person wants to tell Virgo? Mm. They said, <clears throat> if you walk away from them, Virgo, and be single, they got the four cups here in reverse. They know that it's a missed opportunity. You don't have to worry about them knowing, figuring it out, talking about it, recognizing it. Because you walking away from them, they truly feel it deep within that they did not take the cup you had to offer them. And they know that it's a missed opportunity to have a relationship of abundance, love, prosperity. And they're, they, they said they're healing themselves. Not healing themselves, but they're, work, they're healing within themselves. They're working on their healing also. Because they have come to realize that they could have given more or shown up more for you. That they didn't give they all in a relationship. And right now they're feeling lonely without you. And they know that this was a missed opportunity between the both of you. They feel that if you walk away, it's a missed opportunity too because they really feel that they could fix this and bring it back into balance. They just want you to know that, Virgo. 
Virgo, they also said we got um, the Five of Swords. They said they know that they may have competition out there. And it may have been a lot of competition and arguing, fighting, or disagreements. And people, you know, feeling they wanted to win at all costs. They said, but when they lost you, they realized all the fighting was for nothing. Because they lost you, Virgo. And now they would like to stand up and now fight off a different type of competition. And that is competition that's coming in for their Virgo. That is just what I heard. That is just what I heard. All right, let's keep going. So I told you these are quick and simple. All right, so you guys know how I do it on all my readings. If you're dealing with a fire sign, if this is a fire sign telling you this Virgo, they want to offer you a new beginning. Could be dealing with a told you an earth sign, a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. Um, but they want to offer you a, a new beginning. They, they, they want to say they grounded, they understand, and they want to move in. Um in a different direction with you. If it is an earth sign, oh, two cards, okay, spirit. The earth sign said they're waiting on you. And they're going to wait because they seen that you were a gift from the universe. And they are waiting here and hoping that you forgive them and that you heal. Or that you give them an opportunity because they feel that this relationship, it's up to you, Virgo, how you take it, is um, the universe is bringing you guys. This is what they say in Virgo, not me. They feel that the universe gave them this ace of pentacles, which was you. And they waiting for it to come back because this time they plan to do it different. That's just what they said. It's up to you, Virgo. You can take it for what it is. Air. If you're dealing with an air sign, what do you have to say to Virgo air sign? If you're dealing with an air sign. Okay, folks. It must be air and fire. Okay. With the air sign, they know that you've been through a lot and you're guarded. Temperance is patient and reverse, and they feel that you've been through so much that you don't even have the patience and the time to go through it again. That's what the air sign is saying. They like they know you've been through so much with me. I know you don't have the patience and the time. I don't think you're gonna give me the patience and the time again to even start a new cycle with you. That's what the air sign is saying to you, Virgo. They know they hurt you and you've been through a lot, and you're not gonna give them the time of day. If it's a water sign, this water sign is saying to you, Virgo, I'm stuck, I feel stagnant, and I don't feel like I can move forward without you. That is what I see. All right? And you have the food card once again. You have the food card twice. So this person is definitely trying to be the fool to come forth and wrong the rights or hoping that you will... Take a leap of faith towards them and give them the opportunity to roam the right. Okay? And let's just get, uh, in this situation, let's get four cards of love messages. These are my own little love messages. So let's get four of these cards and see. It says, he or she see you as the one. So he or she just lets you know it's male or female, it doesn't matter. But they see you as the one. This person, Virgo, said they see you as the one, basically knowing whatever happened, they screwed up, they didn't put in the work that needed to be put in, and they just can't see themselves without you. Next came out is, I am too angry right now, and it was in reverse. They could have been angry because you walked away, Virgo, and so they didn't come towards the connection, and they're hoping it's not too late. Now that they have started healing and realize you are what they want, they said the answer is yes. The answer is yes. Whatever 
you ask them, Virgo, if you want a commitment long term, you wanted them to show up for the connection, whatever it is you wanted, they're telling you the answer is yes. Like whatever it is that you want, whatever. If you choose to walk away from, I'm also hearing this, if you're choosing to walk away from this relationship, marriage, commitment, especially if it's a marriage, they will sign the papers. They will walk away so that you can go and find your happiness. They don't want to, but the answer is yes. They will give you what you want. Air, space, time, commitment, or non-commitment. One more spirit. One more for this message from to Virgo. What else you want to tell Virgo? Why Virgo listening? Okay, I guess that's it. You only got three. Give me a little more time. Is that the bottom? They may be asking you for a little bit more time, Virgo, before you make any drastic decisions in this relationship. So that is your reading, Virgo. I wish you love and light, and I will see you about mid-month. See where we're at then. Bye, Virgo.